Good morning, everybody. I thought I'd take a, a minute here and show you real quick how I'm going to go about preparing my lunch for the day. Uh, I've got a, a small Cornish hen here. It's about uh, about a pound. Uh, I've taken the wings and uh, I actually take them up and over where the head would be and the, the point of the wing. I take it up and over and then back behind it, like kind of like a full Nelson. And then I tuck it back behind its own shoulders and it helps hold the wings a little bit in place. And then, uh, then I've double wrapped it. I've got two layers of aluminum foil and uh, wrapped it up nice and tight with that. Okay. I'm going to use my can. Uh, it's a, a tin can. I've got eight holes evenly spaced all around the bottom to let air in. It's got a handle on it that I've attached a carabiner so I can hang it. Okay. I'm going to take a uh, one of my light anywhere fire cubes and uh, light it, set it in the can, and then cover it with uh, some charcoal. Now this is going to go outside, obviously, it's not going to be inside the truck, but uh, anyway, now that I've got that started, I will set chicken down inside and uh, we'll use this to cook the chicken. Get the charcoal started nice. Those uh, little cubes do a wonderful job of getting started. As soon as it burns down just a little bit, I've got uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, about twelve uh, pieces of charcoal, and uh, let them get ignited. Set the bird down inside, and then I'm going to hang the can outside the truck, and. Uh, Kind of letting the flame die down a little bit when the charcoal you know charcoal burns uh there's not a lot of big flame from it and uh the little light anywhere wet fire cubes obviously give you quite a bit of a flame so as soon as that dies down just a little bit and the uh, charcoal ignites i will be putting the chicken down in top of it and uh Keep an eye on it. Probably about every half an hour or so, I'll I'll just turn it um, so that it doesn't uh, doesn't burn on one side and gets cooked kind of evenly. But uh, anyway, once it uh, is cooked, it'll cook for a couple of hours, and uh, coal is starting to burn pretty good now. As soon as the flame dies down some, I'll be setting it outside and uh, I'll do a follow-up video showing when it's done. It takes a couple of hours. Uh, anyway, this is going to be the lunch for today. Uh, after about an hour or so of the chicken cooking, I will be adding a foil pack of vegetables on top of it, um, probably potatoes and carrots and uh, probably a little bit of onion. And I'll just cut those up in uh, fairly good sized chunks and uh, double wrap them in foil as well and throw them down uh, and let them cook for the last hour that the chicken itself is cooking. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Like and subscribe if you would. And uh, have a great day. Thank you.